know, economic development is alive and well in Darlington County. Uh, you know, we're coming off, I guess, three years and I guess the current kind of economic malaise that we have been in. Uh, but despite that, we've had some exceptional expansion with our existing industries. And I think that says a lot about the community when your existing industries choose to expand here versus somewhere else. Uh, we've had uh, three significant expansions with existing industries, Sunoco being one of those, just in the last 12 months. The Darlington Raceway uh, Southern 500 that occurs on uh, Mother's Day weekend every spring has a $54 million impact for the PD region. It is very important to our area and absolutely important to the state of South Carolina as well. We're pretty strategically located, uh, you know, we, we are part of the Florence MSA. Uh, we're strategically located uh, you know, at the, near the intersection of I-20 and I-95, so whether from a transportation standpoint, whether you're going north, south on I-95 or east, west on I-20, we're just in a great location to really access the entire southeast. Every community, is, I guess, has its own uh, uniqueness. I mean, Parksville for a small community has uh, got a whole lot more than most people ex uh, would expect. That includes, uh, you know, the strong industrial base. Obviously, Sunoco is headquartered here. But, but, but because of that, I think, you know, we have a lively arts community. So finding something to do in Hartsville is not a problem. It's one of the great things about this community is uh, we really have a lot of, uh, of, of people with vision. In fact, there's an ancient proverb that says that, uh, where there's no vision, the people perish. And uh, this community, I think the reason we have thrived as small communities as we are is we really have a lot of people with vision from our mayor all the way down through the different business executives and the small, the small business owners here, very creative.